Today we're going to be talking about one of the new products we just brought in. Um, this is another excellent invention from the Safari Chiller range. So much like all the other Safari Chillers, it's made of exactly the same material. Um, got a very hard coating on the outside, very very good insulation. It is the Safari Chiller Hipster. That's what I'm calling it anyway. Now, it's one and a half litre capacity. As you can see, just pop open simply. So that. Basically, this has been designed specifically for the guys that are scratching and walking long distances, fishing light tackle, but you can just have this. It's ergonomically designed, sits nicely like that. It's got a nice sort of uh, kidney bean type shape to it, so it sits very comfortably on your hip. Now, that, we've got a strap that will accommodate pretty much anyone from uh, right down uh, children. You can go right to very, very small women, all the way up to uh, one France from the Place. So that will fit everyone like that. You've got a little surface up here, not really designed for being cut on. Um, it's, it's more for preparing your baits beforehand, popping them in here, and then walking your distances, fishing in the areas, and then being able to take a bait out quickly, bait up and throw. So the guys fishing for bronze bream at places like Trafalgar, you've got your main box, got all your baits in there, you prep your baits, pop it into here, then you'll walk along and fish as you go. You don't have to worry about coming back to your box every time to put a new bait on. Now, where this will also help is if you're fishing, say, at the banks and you're going to be what you have to wade through a very deep trough and then you're standing on a sandbank out in the deep and you're going to be fishing from there throwing. You can cut a whole lot of mackerel heads, pop them in here, or bonnie heads, whatever you want, sarder heads, anything, pop them into here, close it up, sits on your hip, it's got a bit of flotation, so if you do by any chance get washed off the bank or something like that, it will float you up, but that's not what it's designed for. Keep it in there, the blood stays inside you, it's not going to leak out, it's not like putting it in a packet where you get a bit of seepage into the water and attracts the, the ever-present zambi. You got your baits in here, you've waded through, you're standing in the back, you can throw, hook your fish, land it, measure it, tag it, whatever you need to do, put a new bait on, throw again. You don't have to wade back through, all the way back and come back, so you don't miss out on any fish. I mean, even guys in something like a shad run or things like that, you can have your sardines packed in here, you're just walking along the beach, finding the shade, clip on, throw, clip on, throw. You know, it's not, you're not losing time. So, it's a very efficient system. It's not for everyone. Some guys don't like having that hip on, uh, the cool on the hip. But it is very, very comfortable. It sits nicely. Um, they're very affordable. And it's made, as everyone knows, the safari chillers are really the top of the, the chiller industry in terms of fishing. And it's, it's very, very rugged, nice and hard, not going to break if you do fall. Um, insulation is fantastic, the foam around the outside seals it nicely and very very nice wide strap. So it's not this thin little pillicky strap that's going to sit and cut into you. This sits nice and widely on there and you can attach anything onto it. You can attach your little uh, the tool belt holder that can sit and you can have your scissors, your cotton, everything on there. So you pretty much can fish from this. And yeah, the Safari Hip Chiller. Very nice little thing. Lovely uh, present ideas if you're needing something, someone that fishes a lot of edibles and you don't know what to get them. Or if you're going up to the bank, something nice to add into your arsenal. Cheers guys.